I win? You have a you have an identification card that doesn't belong to you on your person. Oh, yeah. I got the bracelet. I wonder if she'll get freaked out because this looks like manner gear. Miss Aaliyah, do you uh want a lawyer here with you today? Oh, my lawyer's busy, so. Okay, I'm just gonna read you your yeah. rights. Uh -huh. here, I'm just you gonna right to Yeah, I'm just gonna okay. turn the recorder on first so that way we have it so that way, you know okay. we have it that she's being Miranda, so. Alright. This is uh, 332 High Water. 315 Nakoda. And we're here today with. Oh, uh, <clears throat> Aaliyah Kuhn. Uh, Aaliyah, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say and or do can and will be held against you in a court of law. Uh, we're going to tell her right straight to away. Attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided to you by the state if available. Do you understand these rights as I read them to you? I do. Okay, and knowing these rights, do you still choose to speak with me today? Depends on the questions, but sure. Sure, okay. Dakota, you want to start it off? Uh, yeah, sure. Um, I mean, t TLDR, uh, Aaliyah, honestly, we're here today basically to just, uh, our docket post is ready to go up. Uh, we have everything in line, but we were asking you here today to extend a potential plea deal with you if you are interested in that. And what would that entail exactly? And if it in particular? Uh, in all honesty, it would entail you pleading guilty to the charges that are pressed against you for a reduced time and reduced fine, but there would be, be a legally binding document that would have parameters set that you would agree to, and we would agree to. And what parameters are these? You have something in mind, I take it? Uh, yeah, it would be agreed time and fine. Um, let me double check what I have written up. Yeah, it'd be agreed, uh, agreed time in jail, agreed time of parole, agreed, uh, monetary penalty, and agreed seizure of asset. And that's all you want. So, I get a less time, less fine, in exchange for the asset being seized. Uh, the asset being seized will be part of it. Uh, it also will be you just outright pleading guilty to these charges on the agreement, uh, as opposed to us going through the court proceedings. I mean, it would still need to be thrown up on the docket, uh, viewed by a judge. Your legal counsel would have to agree to this, and then we would let the court system know that we've come to an agreement. Uh, we've, we would all sign the agreement, and then you would be sent up for your, your time. And you go so, on parole. Uh, I'm going to read to you the the charges uh, that you're being charged with. Um, there's 18 of them. One times weapon trafficking. Five times attempted murder of a government employee. One time production of a controlled substance. One time possession of a pharmaceutical drug without a prescription. <laughs> one time drug trafficking. One time resisting arrest. Six time possession of a stolen identification. One time criminal possession of a firearm class one. And one time felony possession with intent to distribute. Oh, is um Is that it? Is that all? Yeah. Yeah, those are those are the charges that we're levying. All right. And um what's the final time of these eighteen charges exactly? So we worked out uh a plea deal. This is less than if we would push for if we sent it to court. Um Nakota, what I don't wanna get it wrong. What did we decide on for the plea? For the plea agreement, we decided on four years in prison, four years of parole, a $1 million fine, and the seizure of a 17 Procopio drive to the state. And that's without it going up on the... Uh, it would go up on the docket with those already parameters in there, but we were asking for much, much more if this was just going to be a straight docket case. And if this was a case, and then what would it be then, as opposed to this? Uh, 15 years in prison, 15 years of parole, a $1.5 million fine, and the seizure of 17 Procopio Drive. I'm going to be honest with you, Olya, being caught with the amount of guns that you had on you, weapons trafficking, and everything we found in the room. Her raid, lawyer's not going to agree? That's not good for her, then. Copious amounts of, of evidence to push all of these charges. She, we're not asking her to snitch even. We don't, we don't want to put you in jail for 15 years. Yeah, 14 years off a prison sentence and a, and five hundred thousand dollars less is, and like we said, this is um, 
we're not looking for a, a concrete answer here and now. We're, we're aware that your lawyer is busy. We wouldn't even think about asking for an answer right now, but that is the the deal that will be on the table um, if you want to let your, your lawyer know. And uh, if it's something that you're willing to entertain, we would like to meet with you again and uh, try to, you know. So I walk away here. I confer with a lawyer, and then I just, what, well, I, I get back to you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you let us know if uh, you would be willing to sign that agreement or if you want to go to court. We would give you the rest of tonight and tomorrow. If we don't hear back from you, we would push it to the docket for the full time and fine. Uh, and then if we hear back from you and you want to take the plea deal, we would proceed. Uh, William, no. and, and, and that's all. No interrogation, no questions, no desire for any insight. That's all you want from me. If you have information you want to provide us, you are welcome to provide us with that. I'm welcome to. Yeah, but to be honest, Leo, we're not sure if there's anything you can tell us that they would be don't valuable. Already? Valuable. Go on. All right. Well, I will uh, confer with a lawyer of mine. Okay. I'll confer. All right. Sounds good. Um, other than that, we will cease discussions of the plea deal and the court case in general, and uh, we will shut off the recording. It is August 29th, 2024. Uh, shutting this off. All right. Beautiful. That was all we wanted you here for. You're, uh, you're free to go, and uh, we'll hopefully talk to you tomorrow. All right. Well, I appreciate the opportunity. Yeah, of course. Thank you, for, Thank you for coming down and talked with us. Of course. Do you have a, a lawyer? I do, yes. Uh, Lang Bunner. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, I love Lang. I hope in a good way, in the sense of you like him as a lawyer. Uh, Yeah, I mean, he's, everyone really seems to like him uh, in their corner, so. Hmm, that's a good sign. Lang's going to be like, you're cooked. Can I ask for, for one clarification? Sure. Yeah, sure. Is that non-negotiable, your offer? Uh, n I would say nothing's not negotiable, but we would need to, uh, you know, come together and see what's what. Going. Okay. Yeah. But well, again, I appreciate the talk. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Hey, you have a good day now. Yeah, you, you too. too. Bye, Miss Aaliyah. Yeah. All right. She would have sung like a bird if we'd asked. You think? Yeah. Yeah, but I do agree. There's not. There's no information she's gonna Unless give us. It's gonna be revelatory. That could actually, lead to an arise. Like, uh, as big as this one. Unless she's. You know? Well, unless she said, "Hey, go to go to X." You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Time for the bit. Right. So. It's happening. I don't know. They're doing interviews. Should we go check your documents? I hope she takes a deal. I think she will. Or a, a variation of it. I hope so.